Lang, 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 wah, 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 bum, 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 bum. This is the story of living simply in Sicily. Why don't you come along with us and sing along the way? If you had a favorite group that you used to sing with, try and imagine you can still hear them now. Hi, I'm Gigi. And I'm Chico. And we're living simply in Sicily. Today we thought we'd take you to Ikea Sicily Ikea so you can just see if there's any differences. I don't think there is, but maybe it'll be fun for you. Let's hope. One of the things that we're um, checking out in Ikea is uh, outdoor kitchen that we'll be doing when we go back to Florida and kind of like what we would need to accomplish that on the inside of a small shed. So that's what we're looking at, getting ideas. More fun. <laughs> so kitchen. This is kind of cool. It's, I don't know what the top is made of. All the drawers are, oh, dishwasher, everything's hidden. Mm -hmm. That's cool. Oh, that's nice, huh? So the silverware in the first row. Yeah. Bigger utensils, cutting knives, and yeah. serving stuff. And then smaller stuff. In. Yeah, that's a nice, nice thing. I really like how they have the shelves open like that. It's a big long, long thing for all the stuff to hold. I mean, I don't think for that we would need any more than just this section right here for a kitchen, right? Good size um, island yep. for three forty nine. dollars That's not bad. Tiles themselves would probably cost, you know. See, I like the look of the tiles like that. Only I don't like the red so much, but I do like just a little section of it, you know. I know it's not your favorite. It's just little dowels. I like that. I like that color. I like this color. Yeah, and that's 449, so that's pretty good. It's an L shape. Right, mid century modern looking. Yeah, I, I like it. Yeah. I mean, you still hit it, but yeah. for the most part. That's not too bad for 199 for a chair. Very expensive. Alright, this is made for the outside, I'm assuming. So, this is 59. And this is a good idea where you can hook hook your stuff to. I mean, we could make those easily, but it's only seven bucks for those. $50 for the back part. Yeah, it's this one's 50 now. Yeah. yeah. Is it? The refrigerator is 776. 779. Yeah, that's pretty good for... For the refrigerator? Yeah, from what I've... What I've been seeing for prices for refrigerators, yeah. uh, and I don't know what the height is. This one's bigger than that. Is it? Yeah. Kind of good for... Uh, Outside. Yeah. It's, it's, it says it right here. I can't read it. Alright. I don't know. I'll just do it like this so I can take a picture yeah, of it. We can look at it back. Yeah, so basically, we would just, we would just need this section. We would only need to like here, that's all I would require. Do they have one of those over the sink things? I just wanted to show people. Yeah, so so this is what they have in Italy that you have. This is where you put your drying racks and it just... This one has the tray. Okay, that one has the tray that comes out. It catches the water. Yeah. But we love this because it keeps you from having to have anything on the side. And it just, you wash it, you put it up there, and then when you need it, you just take it down. So I just love these things. Devils is a cabinet. Oh. It's just so handy that sure you can look it up. 
I love that. Oh, it's pretty good for 12 euro. Right now, the dollar and the euro are even, so they call it parity. It's a little stool, but I like the idea of it. <laughs> This kind of reminds me of our our tile that we did in the back at home. Everybody's putting this kind of board in front of their pieces to, you know, make them look a little bit more high end. It's a good idea. Okay, this is what I like. So this is 189. Should it stand? It might be okay outside. I think it would be. Yeah. Oh, it would be better than anything else in there. But I don't know the alloy. Jeff used to weld, so he knows alloys and stainless. Stainless? It doesn't say the, the alloy. Okay. What you do want is 304 stainless. Oh, okay. It's more of a commercial grade. This is pretty sweet. Oh, yeah, that one's much nicer. Yeah. When we get back home, we can look this up okay. in English. Yeah, I, I just want to see what, what it's called. Yeah, I like this one. Same with that one, you know? Yeah. To move around, it's on a wheel. Right. So if you had it in a kitchen, you wanted to roll it around and right. go outside with it. Yeah. Th this one, that top is crap, might be fake. I don't know. Yeah, it looks it's like it. No, it's not. It's real. Oh. I can tell by the weight. Oh, Grass color. Uh, an outside sink. You could do dishes in here, right? Sure. This is just 69. Yeah. Usually, the outside sinks are basically. Yeah. A, a uh, like a bar sink. Right. Or behind the bar. You know? Right. This one is big enough to. Yeah, that's to, good. To I'm utilize as a, a little wash sink. Refrigerators, Jeff. I wonder if we can check out what the size is because I've seen them like on Amazon. So what does that say? I need to see the height. 50 by 54 centimeters height. 141.8 centimeters. Do you know what that is? No. Okay. Because the the prices that I've been looking at for like is about this price. But if this is 55, I think. Are you five feet tall? Yeah, like five one. Okay, so 60 inches would be you. So okay, so this must be 55 then. Yeah. Okay. Exactly. Okay, so the 55 is that. That's not horrible. I mean, we could probably get enough stuff in it. Yeah. Well. Because the one I was looking at is 65, so it would go up 10 inches over that to like right where that red line is, right? Yeah, something like that. A little bit higher, maybe. Yeah. But that's a pretty good size. It is pretty good. You know? Now, this one has got the freezer, I think, on the bottom. Yeah. Oh, no. It doesn't have a freezer. That's a crisping drawer, maybe, or maybe that is a freezer. No, I think it's a freezer. Okay, so this has got the bottom freezer. Okay, so this is the price, five fifty-five for, this is the size I think I was looking at online, and it's more like seven. That's really big. Let's say, I'll look it up later, what the dimensions are. But that's plenty big enough. I think, I think I prefer the smaller one. What about you? Yeah. Is that big enough? Yeah, uh, you know, you don't want. Yeah, this is six ninety nine. Only because it's stainless. Yep. And oh. <laughs> open it up the wrong way. I yeah. cheated. I looked at what it is. <laughs> yeah, that's plenty big. That's huge. Yeah, I don't think we need that much, do we? No. I don't really think we need that much space. I think I think we could probably get like a small one like that. What do you think? Is it too small? I don't know. It might be too small. Open it again. Three fifty. Yeah. Yeah. Now this, you're always bending over to get everything because yeah. the freezer's little, on top. Yeah. You know? Yeah, I'd rather have the freezer on the bottom. So that so would be this. So this has one. a bigger freezer, but it has less less of this. You notice? Yeah. That's your freezer there. This yeah, is your freezer see here. It. See the difference? Yeah. And that yeah. one, I think, is a little bit more squidgy. It Can is. you open that, the top? That one's narrow. Please. Thank you. Yeah. I think that has enough room for us. Daily. It? think so? Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah, All right. Well, that's good information. It's 575. That's, that's nice looking refrigerator right there. Mm -hmm. That price, huh? Yeah. 
Well, those things in the back of there. Yeah, they can stand. Right, so right. It's, it's, it looks It'll be taller the same than it height is. As the other one over there that we saw. Oh. Yeah. Maybe a little bit more room in there. All right. Be okay for inside, but as soon as we got outside, not good. I like the pegboard. This one's 42. I like how they have the drawers that keep coming out. <laughs> I think I do anyway. Dishwasher. Maybe one reason why it's expensive because it, that's built in. Yeah. But this one is, I think, is a better value. I don't know yeah. why. I like that over there. Please. How much is that one? Does it include? Does it include the I, I gas? It, it probably includes the, the, the cooktop and, yeah. and, and this. I don't know. Yeah. We've got a decent oven. Yeah. I don't know if it's got a price on it, but I don't know if it comes with it. Yeah. Let's see, they price it all individually, and then if you, to put it all together, it's I that think, price. I think the uh, the oven is eight hundred dollars extra. The basic top, I think, is thirteen. Incluso. No, the price includes. It says. Oh, is that what it says? Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah. I the see. Preso include. I see. Mobile cucina. And if you n it doesn't include the accessories, the light, uh, I don't know what Miss Well, it's a possibility. Even something like this is like well, enough the a, size, you know. Some of it in a bit. Yeah. Like a refrigerator. Yeah. And that kind of yeah. it's just going to be in an air conditioned environment. Right. It's going to work easier. Right. But the. Uh, the cooking stuff can actually be outside. Yeah, I, I don't mind that. No, but yeah. simple, you know as well as I do, even yeah. in the winter time in Florida, it's not yeah. that bad outside. So maybe if we had the sink, like just a sink in one of these cabinets where we could store all of our cupboards and then uh, a refrigerator, that would be all we would need inside, right? Inside of a shed? Yeah. Electric. Yeah, that's true. Put a 220 service in and yeah. then just put the induction thing in. Yeah, that's we a good idea. We did that idea. at the drill. Remember, we, yep. we cooked breakfast and there was yeah. all yeah, kinds of stuff Yeah, it's definitely in usable. And it's very small, no gas bottles. Right. You know, no one bottles. Right. That's only 1700 Yeah, know. that would be all we would need is to have a sink, a yeah. place to put our, our, uh, yeah, I like that. Yep. Yeah. So what's this one called? Probably this. Yeah, I don't know what comes with it. That's the only thing. Okay, it includes the structure, uh, cooking, worktop, and the electric part. So it would be this one. Yeah. And, you know, and this will run on 110. Yeah. You don't even need 220. Okay, that would Because the only time you use it is when you're cooking. The rest of the time right. it just sits there. It's not like it's sucking up juice. It doesn't include the lights. And I think this is miscellaneous, miscellaneous, like this stuff, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's what I mean. Yeah. But it has a sink, you know, plenty of storage. Oh, yeah, drugs are huge. Yeah. Well, you could, is this a dish? This is a way to store your things. It has the three, mm -hmm. you know, the three. Yeah, I like yeah, that. I guess that's what... Because it has another drawer. Yeah. And you can even put, like, your grocery, groceries in there. Wow. Well, that's that's the idea. That's yeah. just why they're showing it like this. Yeah. Bottles and yeah. glassware, you know, your cookware. Right. Even this. Yeah. All your garbage stuff on the bottom. Yes, there's no drain, but the drain goes out the back. Okay. It's straight out the back, so. Right. And the bottom part is all your trash. Yeah, all your trash stuff. Yeah. Your uh, organic or something. Yeah, that would be good for us, and we can just compost yeah. it. I think this might work if we had if we put it inside, you know.
Right. So you probably you might not come with the faucet and stuff. You know, they, 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 it fools you when you look at it. It might not come with the sink. Well, this is the Lavello. The Lavello is the sink. Yeah. So, right here, it comes with that. Okay. Come with the faucet. I would think it would come with the whole sink. I would think so too. But... And it comes with the worktop, which is which is this, and it yeah. comes with this. So so. There's Riferigio. Re re yeah, but I don't know what that one, what that one means. Maybe it's this upper structure. Maybe it's this. Maybe. It... Right. That's nice looking. Yeah, it is nice looking. We wouldn't need all that though. That's too big. Oh no, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like I said, that one I saw online for $375. bucks. i would have bought that thing in a second. Yeah. It included the granite tops and the set. And the faucet. Right. Yeah, see, this is the size I was talking about. Yeah. So this is 500. I like, this is the size. This would be perfect for fit the stuff that we put in the refrigerator. Yeah. yeah, I like this one. Yeah, definitely. Definitely has enough room. All right, so this one. Go. This one. Would be an island sink with everything just all in the middle, you know? You could do that too. But then it would take up the middle of your building. You yeah. Know, if you did it that way. Yeah. Probably wouldn't be the best idea. That's the last time we looked at it. Really? I think so. I think they've, they've stepped it up. Mm -hmm. With designs, colors, layouts. Yeah. They've gotten yeah. Know, a little more. Even this is enough for us with just this rack. See, I like, I just like the rack if we don't get the whole thing. This is perfect. This is perfect. Just get. Yeah, it's all right Yeah. 35. 35 euro, that's perfect. You can put enough plates up there. And yeah, and definitely. And cups and oh, glasses or whatever. I like that idea. People. That's really all you need. Yeah, and then this is 8 euro for that. And then you have your towel rack, this whole thing. You know? And then 27 for that. That's cool. And then this is the little sink. Could you do dishes in that? Sure. All right. Oh, maybe we should just go even smaller. And then this one has just a place where you would put your cooktop on top of this is six six ninety four. It includes the structure, the work surface, the sink, and the electro. Uh, I can't see good enough. <laughs> oh, here's an even smaller one. Even this would work for us. And then you put that thing on top instead of this, right? I don't know if it includes a top part. So this would include. The structure, the work surface, the sink. But I mean, you would have a little work, a whole little kitchen. This is really all we would need inside, right? And then you could put that thing over there on top of the sink and just put your plates and stuff, right? You're kind of going to focus on one thing or the other, you know, the beginning. Yeah. What about this? <laughs> That stove. Yeah. For a thousand. That's a gas cooktop. Yep. I'd go with the electric. The yeah. Electric. Only because we don't have gas access. Well, we're going to put electricity into the, into the shed. You might as well run everything with electric. All right. I mean, this might be a, a, a possibility that you could sit here and do your studying and your crafts and your artwork. And then does it fold up? Put the table on the I wonder if in a, in the states it comes with those. I hope so. Like set up like that. Look. Okay. They have the same thing. see what they Okay, this must be the short refrigerator then. Yeah. 
That's like 55 inches. Shorter than that. Yeah. If it's a, a little bit wider and a little bit taller, it really doesn't take up. This yeah. part doesn't matter because right. you know the ceiling's going to be like seven feet tall, eight feet tall, whatever. Right. A shed ceiling. Is. I wonder if they have these at IKEA so I can do my laundry like I do it here. Yeah, I like the whole color and everything. Yeah, this would be all you'd need for in a small space, a kitchen. Works top, huh? Yeah. Plenty of storage and Yeah. This is high for me. Okay, cut the lights off. I'm sorry. I know it. Yeah. Here comes up. I was thinking this yep. might work because you could put it up for sewing, crafting, and then you want to have, you know, everyone seated at it, you can use it as a table. Right. You know? exactly. That's a good idea. It says this is what it's made out of. Who did it, but then I want to go back home. The chairs are 45 bucks a piece. Mm -hmm. But you could do like, this would be a good inside outside kind of a table. Well, the other thing is, if we have like a roof or a canvas above it, right. to provide shade. Right. You know, it's not going to get this street enough as much as it would. Right, so this is what it looks like opened yeah. up. It's pretty good. Yeah, it's hard to sit at it though. You see it? Yeah, the gate leg part. You can sit on the ends, but. Yeah. Sitting on the side is not practical. Yeah, that's true. Jeff is so good about figuring the problems. <laughs> this looks like it might be like an outdoor bar. Is it outside or inside? need a little pad it's a little hard on the button yeah <laughs> but it's uh the stools are high enough and this is low enough yeah so that it makes it nice i'm comfortable sitting just like that yeah old bar top yeah most of the bar tops are higher and the stools are all right. higher and, yeah. and then like you can't put your feet on the ground yeah <laughs> it's not gonna be that comfortable <laughs> yeah thicker one This isn't tables. too bad. It's like a picnic table right. thing. You see eight people easy, easily here. Right. And probably ten. Right. If you really had to. You could probably get two people here. I, I could probably use <clears throat> it for sewing, for everything we would need and, and company. It's big. Yeah. It's a big table. It might be too big. Yeah. See? This you is know? good too. So to have a table that's convertible that can be used for either eating or or uh, recreational purposes, you know, for, for crafts. Or, right. That makes sense to me. Mm -hmm. So you think they have like all this kind of stuff in the States like this? Yeah. It must, huh? I like these because you can fill them up with water and put them in the refrigerator. Yep. They have. It's pretty similar oh, to this. I really like that. What a beautiful color. Oh. We found some things that are usable. 
some things that are really not usable. Uh, there is a variety of things to pick from size-wise to fit the space that you have.